people, right? Show them what's up. Oh, yeah. Yep. The what, Medina? They'd be, they'd be doing a funky cold Medina fucking catfish flop after getting the fucking tongue in the ass, bro. <laughs> they love that shit. Totally. <laughs> yeah. Uh-huh. They, they'd be taking chunks out of the dresser with their fingernails. <laughs> Fucking sticking your tongue all up in that shit, man. They fucking just go bananas. Right. If they have a uh, banana unclean asshole, then they're not fuckable anymore. Oh, no. They're still fuckable. Well, that's for sure. Just got to make sure they wash that shit before you stick your tongue in there. Right. Nothing worse than having the tip of your tongue meet a fucking turd. Yeah. That's that's not good. It's nasty. Yeah, you got to make sure that shit's fucking cleaned up. There are girls that do like that kind of no, shit, though. like, come on. I gotta clear the blowhole before I fucking stick my tongue in there. Right. Yeah. Make sure it's clean. Totally. Yeah. Because if it's not, you get blue waffles. Yeah. No, I don't want no blue waffles either. What does uh, waffle vagina look like? Waffle vagina? Yeah. yeah. I think it's like crusty mushroom looking. It really says I've ever seen a waffle vagina. But... A lot of mosquitoes out today. Especially eating girls' pussy out. <laughs> oh, man. There's a skeeter on my Peter, knock it off. <laughs> There's a skeeter on my Peter, knock it off. <laughs> There's one on my mother. Another on my brother. There's a skeeter on my Peter, knock it off. Now, now recording, I'm not seeing to that. Now there's a girl going down Kentucky. And she meets a guy named Santa Claus. So Santa Claus says to the Peter and the Skeeter, Why don't you be my wife, Peter? So I fist fuck her ass with glass. Oh! Snap. That just tore up. And that's how you ruin a pussy. Uh, yeah, that's fucking pretty much good. Yeah, that wouldn't be good. I'd be so fucked up. Porno, like a BDSM or oh, something. No. no, that's beyond that. It's like fucking chainsaw massacre shit. Right. Now sing me a fucked up song. I already did. Oh yeah, that's right. I'll sing you another one. George and George and Vanessa were going to the store, and they saw a bitch knocking on my door. So I took my sandals and fucked her on the floor. And I grabbed some chocolate, and I grabbed her, grabbed her by the by galore, and I fist fucked her with tomatoes and salsa. So I grabbed some chipotle and some chipotle and some picasa. I don't know. I sound Mexican now. Ole vato. Ole vata. <laughs> yep, back in nineteen forty-four. I was out fucking a dirty whore. The old man came home from war. <laughs> knocked on my fucking door. And entered it with a 44. Nice. And now I ain't fucking her anymore. Right. <laughs> nice. Here we go. I'm going to reverse that and make it even more fucked up with a 44. And I came on this girl while she was on the floor. And she was fucked. And she was bruised. And I took some shrooms. And I put my finger within her womb womb and i pulled out a fucking room room so i grabbed a chainsaw and stuck it in a broom so i took the broom and mangled her shroom and i put my finger down her mushroom so i grabbed my fingernail and i Drag her or something. It's good shit, cause I'm yeah, gonna you, fuck your mother. Yeah, you better chop that shit up. Fuck it. Yeah, it's kind of choppy a bit. Make it funny. Like El Chapo corn porridge, right? El Chapo. Mm-hmm. And that's why they call me Trail Mix, cause that's El my. El Chapo, the most wanted man in Mexico. Right. They tracked that fucking bandit down and shot his ass. With some glass, amigo. No glass, no. Not glass, amigo. Shot him with the they shot him with the 45. Yeah. Boom. That, that motherfucker was done, Dilla. amigo. Dilla raza. Chinga, pinche, pinche puta. Huevos cabrón. Beachy madre. What is 
pussy and big fucking balls got to do with it. And pelotas! Some huevos right over there and some huevos over there and... What does fucking age got to do with it? I didn't say anything about age. Huevos? Huevos. Mi cachonda! Murda! Marican!